In this video lecture, I am going to find the value of A and B. And this is the polynomial, quadratic polynomial that is given AX square plus 7X plus B. And the two root that's already given 2 by 3 and here X equal to minus 3. So let's see the answer. So first here I am going to write the given polynomial fx equal to ax square 7x plus b. Now thereafter let first so here first 0 alpha and second 0 beta now we know the formula sum of 0 so here sum of 0 that is alpha plus beta minus b by a that means minus here coefficient of coefficient of x divided by coefficient of of x square so here we can write alpha plus beta so first 0 is now 2 by 3 and here the next is minus 3 so coefficient of x that is here minus 7 and coefficient of x square a now you need to calculate this one then you can get the value of a so this is 2 by 3 plus minus minus 3 and this is your 7 so there is so coefficient of uh, x square that is a here so this is now a after that uh, this is minus or uh, divide by a this is 1 is the LCM 3 2 9 minus 7 by a and this is now minus 7 by 3 minus 7 by here a so 7 7 that cancel one times and here a value you can get 3 now the next is uh, multiplication of 0 product of 0 that going to write so product of zeros that is alpha into beta here c by a so constant term and a is now coefficient of x square so constant terms is now we need to check that so here constant term is now b and uh, here x coefficient of x square a b by a so this is now we can write b divided by a and alpha into beta so alpha value is now we need to see the alpha values so first 0 is now 2 by 3 and the second is minus 3 2 by 3 into minus 3 into minus 3 this 3 3 cancel and now this is minus 2 and here b a value calculated 3 so in the side you should write a value is now 3 after that do the cross multiplication so b equal to minus 2 into 3 minus 6 so this is the b value so a value is not 3 b value is minus 3 so this is the way we can get the value of this a and b of this quadratic polynomial first write the given then assume first 0 alpha second 0 beta sum of 0 alpha plus beta that is minus coefficient of x divided by coefficient of x square then 
put the value of alpha and beta first zero given 2 by 3 and the second zero minus 3 2 by 3 plus minus 3 then after minus c by coefficient of x square a calculate then a value you can get here 3 product of 0 that is constant term coefficient of x square so alpha value is now uh, put that 2 by 3 and beta value is now minus 3 then after b by a so b value is now constant terms so here alpha into beta so b and a put the value and a value put then you can get here a value is minus 6 so this is the way we can get the value of a b so i hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you